I think the trends affecting family offices, number one is, first, the amount of information that's out there for the family office is a huge challenge for them to decipher everything, especially when they have the smaller number of employees you know, or outside advisors. I think inflation is going to have a much bigger impact going forward than people anticipate. You know, under Biden, we've had a little over 17% inflation stated. However, when you look at a lot of major categories like gasoline and fuel and things of this nature and food, you're up over 30%. So the question is, is even though the rate of inflation is coming down, there's that embedded inflation. So the question there would be is, where is the family office investing now and in the long term? Because that's going to have a large fallout in the future. And then with our federal deficits continuing to go up and up, the question then becomes, how long will these interest rates now stay high? Some people now are saying it's going to be now forever, probably be somewhere in between. So I, I really think the family offices in 2024, I think the main item is going to be based on the risk, the risk to the family office in many of the categories that we talked about you know, a few minutes ago. 